Friends, thank you all that have following me up on this channel. Thanks for your support. If you have been watching, you have not subscribed, kindly click the red subscribe button and the bell beside it so that you get notification. Don't forget to share, like, leave your comments at the comment section. So my people, I bring you another news happening right now. Do being there. I'm a barracks there. It's on fire by non government. Since the Fulani soldiers don't want to leave Biafra land, then don't also forget that the 40 days has completed. Like Mazen and the Kano said, we do not want to see any checking points in Biafra land. We do not want to see Fulani police, Fulani soldiers checking points in Biafra land. Anything falls in that zoological republic. We do not want to see their checking points in Biafra land. We gave the Fulani soldiers and police 40 days to leave Biafra land, but they didn't leave. They're still in Biafra land. They should be ready for what is coming. It's obvious they don't know what is coming for them. This is just the beginning. Unknown government have not started with them. Unknown government, please, you people should not stop until all the enemies of Biafra go down. You people should not stop until all our enemies are no more in Biafra land. You people should not stop. Unknown government freed 2,000 Igbo youth in one prison. In Imo State, 2,000 in one prison. Now ask yourself, how many more is not a prison in that zoological republic? 2,000 Imo youths in one prison. No full and for seven in the prison. No single one. 2,000 Imo youths in one prison. And the police IGP gave order to shoot aside any IPOB member you see. But since a week and now that the Fulani killed our people in a brain state, they have been unable to identify those that carried out the attack. You see what is happening? When it's about the Fulani, you see them playing their Fulani cow brain, it's in mind games. But when it's about our people, you see them taking action. You see them taking action, looking for those. Within a few minutes, police officers were able to identify those that carried out the attack. But since a week and now, they have been unable to identify those that killed our people in a brain state. They haven't seen anything. This is just the beginning. You see all of them that don't want to leave Piafra land, they will see that thing they are looking for. None of men have not started dealing with them. That is why we are happy with what we are doing. But do you know that our people are their own problem? Do you know that a lot of people have started condemning on non of recently? That is why they are using our people against us, against our freedom. You are fighting for freedom. And unknown men from nowhere, we prayed for our people to avenge their death. They came from nowhere. And they are doing the good work or the things we have been asking for Elohim to do for us. To avenge the death of our people. Angels from nowhere appeared. And they have been doing a great work. And some of us are saying they should stop. It's getting scary. What is wrong with you people? No, like seriously. What is wrong with our people? I know there are a lot of accounts with fake names or fake Igbo names. But men looking at the profiles and everything, these people are our people. They are our people. I'm not sometimes name our people. What is really wrong with them? We are being killed since we started our agitation. The Fulani soldiers and police. They have been killing us. And we have been asking Elohim to avenge the death of our people. We have been asking our people. That died to avenge that death. Or none of men appeared from nowhere. And they are doing all we have asked Elohim to do for us. And some of our people online saying they should stop. It's getting scary. It's too much. Nye, 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 nye. How can you describe the killings of our people? So the killings of our people, it's not much, Abby. When will you people learn? Well, that is you people's business. Our only concern is that our non men are doing a great job. And they will not stop until all the Fulani soldiers, all the enemies of beer friends are no more in Biafra land. That is the truth. This is just the beginning. They haven't seen anything. They haven't seen anything at all. This is just the beginning. They haven't seen anything. The Fulani sees Biafra land as a conquered territory. That is why they are coming in every now and then doing whatever that pleases them. Do you know what a devil Maya said of recently? That they are ashamed of themselves. No, they shouldn't be. They shouldn't. This is just the beginning. Unknown government have not started dealing with Fulani soldiers and police. For some of you posting, eh, ESN and unknown government should remember there are people in Nigeria. I'm sure they can't even know who. Nya kete pane wu ko na kaba bushu ni ni nya utole utole babu ni ni. Those your brothers, you people are saying unknown government and ESN should remember. Did they not hear when our leader said they should resign, that they will receive double of the change that Nigerian Fulani government are paying them? Did they not hear our leader asking them to resign, that they will receive double of their salaries? 
No, those were brothers. Are they deaf? Didn't they hear him? They want to remain in Nigeria army wearing uniform with those their outdated guns intimidating and killing our people. They should be ashamed of themselves. The Fulani soldiers or Fulani government will send them to Sabisa Forest to go and die there. They will still send them to their own land where they were breaded to kill their own people. And they will still come. They should be ashamed of themselves. They should they haven't seen anything. Nya any of them they must receive the gospel. That is the truth. We don't care to know if you are a brother or not. Once you agree to walk with the oppressors or to walk with the enemies of your people, you will call our enemy. Those that don't want us to leave. freedom. We are fighting for freedom. We are struggling for freedom, agitating for freedom. If you do not want to work with your people to be free, then continue working for the oppressors. Whatever the oppressors get, that is the same thing you will get. Your tongue will actually decide you treat our, our, our oppressors. That is the same way we treat you. Since you do not want to work with your people for freedom, you will get whatever the oppressors get. Because you see this freedom this time around. It can never be like 1967 or 1970. This time around, I had the bloody. He's a true freedom fighter, a real one, a hero sent by Elohim. So you see this freedom we are fighting for. Because what we are fighting for is freedom. Those that don't want us to be free, if you know where the legs are, eh? you, you will not dare sabotage what we are fighting or struggling for. If you know where they, where they put their legs, but you people don't know. If we are doing whatever we are doing to get our freedom, you people will start saying, it's not good. Remember our people in Nigeria Army, remember this, remember that. But they are sending them to their own land to kill their people and they are coming. They are foolishly coming. And you're talking about your brothers in Nigeria. I mean, who knows them? Who are they? We ask them to resign that they will receive double of their salary. They should support what we are doing. But they refused. And you're telling us to remember them. They haven't seen anything. We are even asking a non-government to first of all kill all of them. Wipe all of them out. Because they are our greatest enemy. Oh, I wouldn't do wrong if you don't know. Those are our people still in Nigeria army that they're sending to Biafra land to kill their own people. They haven't seen anything. They will receive the you see when Rosioma and Ambassa, you know how you pulls or receive where before the full and near receive because all how a car won't do run you. They are enemy of their own people. How you pulls or receive what that was your man. Tell them that whatever non government serves full and soldiers, that is the same thing they will serve them. Whatever full and soldiers get from a non government, that is what they themselves will also receive. They will receive more than they should continue working for the oppressors and will keep serving them whatever will serve the oppressors. Mad people everywhere. Jare benine benine. Chineke kukunu wako umu nunu nuna soja. Wako boyu nunu nino. You people are right telling lie. Remember they have brothers in Nigerian army. But our leader asked them to resign. Those that have sense resigned. You people are telling an angel to remember you. Who, who are those your brothers? Who are they? Who are they working for? They don't want you to be free. They prefer working for the oppressors. They prefer the peanuts they are getting from them. Chineke kukunu wako. Chitabukwa nunu. That said we will not be free. Thank you, my people. God bless you. Don't forget to share, like, leave your comments at the comment section. Obi in the barracks is on fire. Non government has visited them. That is what we want. That is what we want. Because freedom I in our fight. 
we must get our freedom. We must exit that contraction, whether peacefully or by force. God bless our leader, Mazen Nam the Colonel, ESN, and a number of men. May Elohim guide and protect them. May they continue the good work they are doing until our enemies are no more in Pierre Froland. Isa? 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 Thank you all. <laughs>